what comes in your mind when you hear about the word stream it must be having some origin it must be having some flow it must be having some destination same way in java also streams have origins so today let's talk about various type of origins for stream in java first of all we have a list for this we just need to say list dot stream and this way we can create a stream from a list the next one is set for this also the steps are very simple we just need to say set dot stream and this way we can create a stream from set the next one is map for this one steps are a bit difficult we just need to say map dot entry set which is going to look something like this and then we can create a stream from this now the next one is array for this we need to say stream and then we need to say of and there we need to provide the array till now we were creating a stream from a collection or an array but what if we need to create a stream from a raw data for this we just need to say stream then we can say of and there we need to provide this raw data so it is going to be something like this now this next one is even more interesting here we need to create an infinite stream for this we can say stream and then we need to say generate here we need to provide a supplier so we can say something like this and here since we need to create an infinite so we will be taking help of random here so i can say something like this and then i can say next of int and then it is going to look like this now you tell me in the comments that how we can convert it to a finite stream in the meantime let me tell you a new way of creating a stream so for this we just need to say stream and then we need to say here iterate then here we can provide the starting number then we can provide some kind of condition and it is going to be let's say we want to print it till 100 only so here we can say less than equals to 100 we can also say that at what pace it should increment so for this we can say something like this and i wish to increment by a piece of 5 and this last one is my favorite because here we need to create an empty stream so that is going to be something simple and it is going to look like this hence we have learned eight ways of creating streams do let me know in the comments if I have missed any other origin. Thanks.